Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to an episode of the Non-Cooperators. We are playing Metal Gear Solid Mobile, and I'm actually quite excited about this because this is one of my favorite franchises, and also this is a game I've never played, honestly. I'm playing on the end, well, not really the end gauge. I'm playing on this little, I'm literally playing on this little Nokia phone that I've got hardwired, I got plugged in, uh, so no batteries run out, and it doesn't fuck me up or anything like that, and I got this fucking thing plugged into my computer and everything. So I'm streaming this, and it's very hard to con hold this down and, and everything. Jesus, yeah, it's very awkward to hold it, and it's gonna, it's, this is gonna be, this is gonna be difficult, guys. <laughs> so, humor me. Um, I only saw some very little footage, oh, wait, that's, that's not it, okay. I saw some footage on, online, uh, about this game. Uh, I was playing it for a little bit just to test it out and everything, but I saw some footage online. Not too many people actually do it, and some people are asking for it in English. This is as English as you're gonna get. There is a problem, though, that the sound... In this game, it's very, very, very low, so I'm gonna try to do this as quiet as I can. I'll bring the mic a little bit closer to me, so... All I have to do is just whisper. But, I don't know, I'm, probably, I'm very loud, so... <laughs> uh, I'm actually gonna be looking on this on, on the actual screen instead of this thing, because I'm wearing my glasses, but still, it's... Yeah, just let it, let it be lost, it doesn't matter. This is, this is actually my first time playing... Well, my first time I'm gonna be playing through from beginning to end. I kinda like died in the game. It's it's not easy, because honestly I'm gonna be controlling with uh, this little pad right here, and uh, there's only these action buttons, which is a play and a stop button, which is punch and first person view. And these graphics are atrocious, but honestly, I don't give a shit. <laughs> there's no voice acting in this game, so I don't know if I should provide the voices for them, like I do with all my other games that I play. <laughs> Um, I, I'm, I'm all Metal Gear uh, right now. I'm wearing my Metal Gear Solid shirt yeah, with uh, Meryl and Snake there. I, I like this shirt. I got this shirt uh, a long time ago when I met Hideo Kojima in New York City, which was really, really awesome. It was like the, um, oh, geez, I forgot what the place was called. But uh, they were uh, they had all the shirts in the, um, and I got like three shirts from Metal Gear Solid. And it was, it was and I got uh, a poster signed by him and the art director. So that was really awesome. Okay, I think I'm pretty sure I mentioned that story. Oh, Kodak, here we go. This is Snake. I was about to say, Colonel, do you hear me? I'm so used to that one. <laughs> this is Snake. Otacon, do you read? I, I don't want to skip. There we go. Loud and clear, Snake. Have you entered the facility? I'm in... <laughs> I'm in the utility area. The top level. Getting in was a little easier than expected. Well, you are the best. Hmm... <laughs> This is so... Like I said, this is all on, on, on the Engage mobile. Let's get down to business. Okay, so I'm not... It's going to be difficult to maintain the voices. After uh, the Shadow... Okay, by the way, this is actually ca uh, canning, canned into the story. So it takes takes place right after Metal Gear Solid 1 and right before Metal Gear... Well, right before Metal Gear Solid 2. So... I take it ca as canon, but not too many people do, because no people like not too many people know about it. Now you will. So... After, after the Shadow Moses incident, Revolver Ocelot put Metal, Metal Gear technology on the black market. We already know about that in Metal Gear Solid 2. Now, even major uh, superpower, uh, even every major superpower and a few minor ones are rushing to equip themselves. Uh, production facilities have uh, spun up uh, across the globe, racing day, night, uh, building uh, the working model. Uh, spr uh, sprinting, sprinting towards destruction. Precisely. The building uh, you're in right now is one of uh, is one such facility. Uh, we need to find out as much about the uh, uh, production pr process as, uh, as possible. Have the original plans been altered in any way? Have any uh, exploits flaws have been introduced? Look, for, look for intel. Gain the upper hand. Exactly, Snake. Who's our source? A scientist from the inside the facility. Can they be trusted? I don't know yet. Hmm. Ellipses. What? Can, what does ellipses even mean? Like, how many? How much? How much time do gamers actually put into games when they have to read through ellipses? Sigh. I know, I know, but the intel they provided us has been uh, reliable so far. I'll try digging up some more information as uh, you proceed with the mission. Maybe you should have considered that before infiltrating in a heavily guarded facility. Uh, let's get through the plan again, shall we? Right. Your first objective is to increase... Ah. Joel, I'm sorry, I can't do these voices anymore. Uh, objective is to incre uh, yeah. increase your key card secur security level, granted, uh, granting you the access uh, to more of the facility. You don't actually acquire the key card, you just upgrade the key, ca key card in certain, uh, in certain nodes, I think. I think that that's what they are. Alright, this charger's really in the way. What happens if I pull it out? Nothing, it just stops charging. 
I don't know if it's going to warn me about uh, that I have to charge it, so I'm going to leave it right there. I don't know what the battery life is. I think that's a... Oh, come on, I'm doing my job really well. <laughs> okay, to do that, you'll need to find and log into... A, yeah, there you go, a node. It looks like a computer terminal. You should be able to spot it quickly, uh, qu quick, quite easily. Log in by uh, uh, pressing the action near the node. Uh, take care, uh, it'll take care of the rest. Try to make contact with the scientist as you try to make a facility as well as you provided with the... Uh, invaluable considering information. I'm on it. Remember, if you need any help, you can press the left select key at any time to contact the code. Yeah, there's no so there's no action button or select button. Right. Find the node, snake, you've got to upgrade the key card and security level. Okay, so here we go, guys. So this is how you punch. It's that play button, stop button is first person view, controlling it. Also, the center button is also the action button as well, so this is gonna be interesting. Here's my equipment. I have a Beretta, I have a camouflage, I have a Beretta. Let's use the camouflage because, oh no, I'm sorry, it's a Charmeleon camouflage system. Changes colors in the snaking, in the, in the color of the snake's sneaking suit. Press the action key to select a color. Otacon, the camouflage sampler doesn't seem to be working. Really? Let me have a look at uh, the remote di no diagnosis. I think it may have, I, may, I think I may have gotten banged out during the infiltration. You're right. A rough entry uh, must have caused some of the suit's uh, color sampling and the mim uh, mimicking system losing power. You're going to have to reboot the, uh, the suit from here. How long will that take? Could be a while. Looks like it, looks like it took uh, quite a beating. I thought you said uh, the, entr uh, the entry was easy. It was. Just, just let me know when the reboot's complete. All right. So. It's a camouflage. I'm sorry. It's a charmeleon, a, 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 a charmeleon camouflage system. Basically, it changes colors. So this is basically like the first Octo camo suit. Um, we also have our tranquilizer uh, Beretta, but I don't want to use it because we only have 15 shots in it. And ammo, I, like I said, I played a little bit of it just to see how it's like. And ammo is very scarce. It's very hard to get ammo. Um, if you're lucky to get ammo anywhere, good luck with that. Basically. Alrighty, so. Here we go, we're gonna be playing Metal Gear Mobile, and I really am excited. It's the one Metal Gear game I have not played. So, humor me. It is very low though, so I, I, I admit. There's a guard up ahead, uh, up ahead of you. <clears throat> I can see that. Try not to get spotted, Snake. Oh, I'm gonna get spotted a lot. Not saying that I suck, it's just, this sucks. I know there's a controller for the end gauge. It's the, this is, I think I'm using the N95 model. Wait, oh, by the way, um, uh, I gotta pause right here, uh, of the game. I do need to, uh, do a full disclosure right now. I wanna, uh, give out a special thanks to, um, I got this off of eBay, uh, the game, I'm sorry, the end gauge with the game and a couple of games installed in it. I, um, I, I don't, I'm not too sure, I haven't gotten permission to use this name. Then again, I also didn't get permission to even say anything about this, but I'm gonna leave a link down below because I bought this on, on on eBay, and you could actually buy the game from him. Um, you buy the game from him, but he wants you to send an N gauge to him or one of what this phone to him, and he'll install it for you and send it back. He is 100% trustworthy. I can I can assure that I can vouch for that 100%. So don't worry about it. You can even talk to him and everything, he'll explain everything, he's a really nice guy, I got to know him a little bit, he, um, uh, but yeah, he's, he's a really good guy, um, and like I said, special thanks to him for supplying this and everything. So, here we go. The military, uh, the military may have been uh, hostile, but that's no reason to go around looking for a fight. To stay out of sight, lean against the wall and push uh, towards them, while leaning against the object uh, tor towards away the corner to peek around the corners. That'll give you a chance to watch the guards' patrol routes. If they get too close for the comfort, I recommend using the Silence M9 pistol to tranqu to tranquilize them. Really, Otacon? Here? Why don't you just uh, 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 drive for a bit? Please, Snake. Uh, try, try to take this seriously. One of those uh, darts carry in, uh, enough anesthetics to knock out an elephant, but the time it ta uh, takes for the anesthetics to take uh, effect is depending on where the dart hits. Shoot the guard in the head, and he'll go down in an instant. Sh uh, shoot him in the body, and it'll take a few seconds, or the anesthetics to enter the bloodstream. Any more words of wisdom? Not, n not at the moment. Oh yeah, always remember to wash your hands with soap and water after you use the restroom. I'm guessing that's a thing I'm supposed to be doing. I can break his neck. I can do that. It's just a little difficult to do that because it's it, it, once again it's the action button and I gotta like sneak up on him. It's, it's very it's you can't sneak up on them. It's very difficult. There we go. Got it. Okay. Like it's not easy. It's not. And that's the the the. the, 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 the 
And my, I, I, my movements are very, um, are very, uh, what's the word, chafed? They're like, eh, eh, sluggish. Because, like I said, I'm using uh, this controller. It's a little difficult. It's just a wee bit difficult. So humor me, guys. Humor me. I, I don't see anybody else playing this game. Actually, I do. I, I saw some people playing this game. All the people in Spain or something. I don't even know. First floor store storeroom. Oticon. I see a camera. A surveillance camera. Yeah, I knew. <laughs> Okay. Snake, the corner is covered by a surveillance camera. If you get spotted, you, uh, you'll be knee-deep in trouble. I assume they usually... Uh, <clears throat> I'm the, I, I, I can't do this anymore. It's very difficult. I assume the usual method will work. Yes, lean against the wall directly below the camera. It'll stay out of sight of uh, field of view. Alternative, you can use chaff grenades to disable it. Wouldn't that knock out my radar? Only temporarily. Uh, I think there's chaff grenades in here. Like I said, I've only played this uh, once, and I didn't play it fully, uh, full through. I literally played like a couple of seconds of it. Okay, so we got some chaff grenades. But if we equip something, oh, uh, there we go. If we equip something, um, our action button will remain. Okay, our action button will remain. Uh, it won't remain like a button to use uh, as a, uh, you know, beating them up or anything like that. It's gonna be the action button to like use your item or use your equipment. Which is a little upsetting. Because I have so many buttons over here. I can definitely... I can spare one button. Oh, there we go. Let's get douche. Alright, let me see if I can... How do I get that? Oh, okay. Yeah, also to crouch and, um... Like... Sh uh, what's the word? Crawl? Crouch and crawling? Once again, action button. So I have to, I have to like, go up, I'll go up against, like, a vent or floor where I can uh, crouch and, and crawl and hit the action button. There we go. Snake, I can only get you a level one key card. You need to get level three uh, key card to get through that door. Any suggestions? If you access the computer mode, it should be able to upgrade your current security status by one level. <gasps> I can only do that once per node, though. Dun, dun, dun. So I'm not too sure if this game takes, um, I'm, yeah, I'm sorry, it, it takes place after the first one. I'm not too sure if, I, I think this game was actually made after the second one, though. But I'm actually really happy because I've always wondered what happened to Snake right before um, uh, uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 and after Shadow Moses, like in between that. I'm also curious on what happened to Snake after uh, 2. Alright, so there's two guards in here. It's going to be a little bit difficult. I'm just going to I'm gonna try to sneak, sneak, sneak by them. Uh, oh, whoa. Nope, 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 <laughs> I know, I was gonna go back and forth. Nope, nope, nope! I could trank them, but like I said, I don't want to use my tranks. Because they're very sc Oh, you know what? Shit, I probably do need to go upstairs. God damn you, Cletus Kaleidoth. Uh, that's level two, okay. Uh, okay, here we go. By the way, also that does that- he does that automatically. <laughs> um... Like I said, this game is not easy. Oh, no, 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 no. Get, 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 get back in there. Get back in there. Oh, fuck me. Shit. Oh, you can't see me. Oh, you can't see me. Break. <laughs> um, as I was saying, I know there's... Uh, uh, I, I feel like there are people who actually do play this game. Or... I'm not... Well, play the end gauge on like their phones and everything. And they actually do use a... Um, a controller. I don't have that. I don't know what I need for it. I mean, it was hard enough to get the equi it was hard enough to get this and the wire and everything. So, getting more stuff just to make my uh, convenience more uh, to make my inconvenience more convenient. I I don't I don't I don't know. It's just all a whole bunch of BS. Alrighty then. So let's see where we're at. A node. Alrighty then, so we're gonna hit that node next time. Oh, wait, after this call. Snake, according to the plans I downloaded, it looks like there's a node in the upper right of the room. They must use it to control the central heating and air condition. Speaking of air condition, it is fucking hot in my room. I, I I can't use the fan, it'll start it'll start making too many too much noise on the mic. So I'll be like, hey, good evening, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a So I don't wanna do I don't My suffering, so your 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 pleasure basically. 
If you can get, uh, get access to it, you should be able to increase your security cl clearance to level 2. Um, one slight hitch, there's a guard standing in the way. You're going to have to do something to distract him. Any ideas? Yeah. Knock, knock on the f <laughs> on, on there. You, uh, you can knock on the wall near the guard. You should uh, come and investigate the noise. Then lean up against the solid object and press the, the action button. They should give you a chance to slip on pass. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and do that next time on the Non-Cooperators. And, uh, and also, like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more episodes, because we're going to continue this game. So, see you next time.